Jake, well, we're here at uh, Hartbury College, back in Gloucester Colours, but you've, you've had a, an interesting couple of weeks away with the Italian national team. How's that gone? Yeah, it's gone really well. We're in you know, an unbelievable part of the world. Um, just short of the Alps uh, in Trento. Um, you know, it was it was real good training. Same sort of stuff we kind of do here, but you know, with the 30 degree heat. Um, and yeah, it just makes it a little more difficult changing your schedules just to avoid that as much as possible. Um, but yeah, no, it's been going really w uh, well. And enjoy going out there and um, you know, getting in amongst it and, and learning as much as possible. Um, you know, and then coming back here and, and trying to adapt. Uh, and then we just tapered our programs to what, what we need here and, and, and we're back out there next week, hopefully. Callum, uh, big summer for you in, the, in more ways than one. Uh, we'll, we'll start off with the non-rugby event. You've become a dad. So I have. How, how's life changed? Definitely changed a lot, um, but for the better. Um, you know, we've obviously expected a baby for a while, so prepared ourselves and um, yeah, thoroughly enjoying dad life at the moment. Um, you know, embraced uh, the difficulties, but definitely enjoying the highs, so it's been good fun. And gives you, I guess, a little bit of perspective when it comes to sort of comparing rugby to personal life. Yeah, of course. Um, you know, it's great to be at home and enjoy home life and then come over come over to training and go away to Italy camp and stuff like that and um, make the most of training while I'm there so it's good to get the balance right there. And of course you had the benefit of uh, travelling out and doing a tour to Japan last summer with Italy. Yep. That's really going to benefit you and the squad in a couple of weeks time isn't it? Yeah exactly so it won't be the first time we're going there. I think that was kind of the plan. Um, we went to the places that we're staying in so Sugadaira we're in the mountains that's where that's where we stayed for the majority of our tour and that's where we're going to be staying for the World Cup and, and based. Um, so yeah it's not going to be anything new which is going to be really nice and um, you know it's a little bit of a different time of the year so I'm not sure what the weather's saying but um, yeah no it's, it's still going to be boiling hot and humidity through the roof really. And you say different teammates different personnel I suppose one thing that is helping you settle in is you've, you've got one of your Gloucester rugby teammates already over there in, in Jay Pelletri. Yeah of course he's a um, he's, uh, big aspect over there um, he's a bigger character over there than what he is here that's for sure um, so now it's been good to travel over with him and you know um, getting amongst with him it kind of helps break the ice a wee bit so um, yeah it's been good.